Okay, I think <clears throat> I think the camera's on now. Hi, welcome to a very special episode of Falling Asleep with Mark. I'm Mark, and I'm excited to have you for this really good episode where we are going to do lake flying. Flying and soaring through the air is one of the most relaxing things you can do when you can't get to sleep. And I'm delighted to guide you on this journey as you fly through the air soaring like an airplane or a bird, which will, when you feel the breeze in your face, will feel very relaxing and you'll be you'll be getting so sleepy that it will be an excellent i'm having a good day because i have excellent sunlight today when over the weekend there was a time change i imagine you might be watching this several weeks or even months or years after the time change the spring time change, but there was one of those here over the weekend, and I lost an hour of sleep. As you know, my sleep is very precious to me, and I sleep most days of most hours of the day and most days of the week. And because of the time change, I lost an hour, which is an hour of sleep I'll never get back. So I, I overslept several hours today in order to make up for the hour of lost sleep I got over the weekend. And I hope you find ways to make up lost sleep as well so that you can be more well rested. Let, let's go ahead and do a shorter episode than usual as we fly through the sky. I found this really good video for you, which is called Lake Flying. Lake Flying is by Michael Neves, a pro aerobatics aviation Vimeo filmer who posted this lake flying video sometime last year so that we can all enjoy it, enjoy it, thanks to its Creative Commons by Attribution license. So we can have fun watching it where my face can be in the middle of the screen going like this back and forth to, to mimic the movements of the planes and we can add really nice music and soundtracks to the background so you think Wow, this is a very professionally made show, and I'm glad I'm watching it. And in fact, I should go subscribe to it now and to, to like it and to go to Instagram and click buttons that will be good for the Falling Asleep with Mark channel and show because Mark would appreciate that, and he's talking about himself in the third person now. So let's go ahead and, um, and visualize ourselves flying now, and we'll have a relaxing time. So now we are imagining ourselves in the plane, unless you're a bird, and then just imagine yourself as a bird and you're on the land getting ready to to take off into the sky it's a nice sunny day with lots of sunshine and just a light breeze just enough breeze to have a pleasant flight without it being scary you feel like a pro flyer whether you are a bird or a plane because the weather and wind is so good that it's the easiest flying you've ever done. Now we're taking off into the air and all around you are white fluffy clouds and 
and light and deep blue shades of blue all through the sky. And you can feel just a light breeze on your face as you fly and do aeronautical maneuvers all around the air. As you view, oh look, you're, you look down and you view a lot of different islands and lakes all around you which all look very comfortable and give you a sense of relaxation and soothingness. Now we fly through the air several hundred feet above the ground, but low enough to see all of the detail of the trees and the, the water and the reflection of the sun on the water as you fly by. And as you approach the, the next island, you see some friends of yours hanging out on the dock of, of the bay, wasting time and having a nice time just dipping their feet in the water, which looks warm and luxurious, like, uh, like something out of a, a magazine that's selling you a trip to the Michigan lake and all of the islands and little lakes in the area. So you feel very blessed to have this very, very fun flying opportunity. And you think to yourself, I should fly more often. And whenever I have trouble relaxing or getting to sleep, I should visualize myself flying in a plane or flying as a bird over the lakes and remind myself how much of a fun time I had while doing that. And I should do that all the time because it's one of the best things that you can do to calm down and to de-stress and to get to sleep. Okay, so now that you've flown several minutes through the air, take a moment to reflect on all of the things you are thankful for, including the moment right now to visualize how nice things are in your mind. Be thankful for how calm you feel and how things in your life are going well. The fact that you have things to worry about indicates that you have values and important things going for you in life, and that is something to be thankful about. Maybe you have family or friends or pets or a job that you have right now and that makes you feel feelings of gratitude for being able to have all of that in your life and to have a lot going for you and therefore to recognize that any stress is simply a, a factor of the important necessary responsibilities you have in life that even if it is sometimes stressful you are very grateful and thank you, thankful for it. But it's also nice to have moments in life just to, to put all of that to the side. So we've acknowledged all of the things going on and what to be thankful for, but we're also going to put it aside and for once in life just have fun flying and soaring through the air. So go ahead and after this video is done, continue visualizing yourself flying until you get to sleep. And I think you'll find it to be an excellent way to relax. So that's, that's all for today's episode, this rather short episode of Falling Asleep with Mark. 
thank you for watching and stay tuned for next time when we work on puzzles and watch how long it takes paint to dry on the wall. Bye.